Hi, my name is Kaylee and welcome to The Glow Method. Today we're going to do your favorite and most requested class, a 60 minute sculpt. For this class, you just need a pair of light and heavy dumbbells. I'm going to use threes and fives. So when you have everything ready to go, I will meet you back on the mat. All right, let's start in a child's pose. Take your knees wide, big toes together. Reach your arms in front of you. Let your forehead rest down. Just hanging out here for a full cycle of breath, tuning into your body, allowing yourself to land right here, right now. Take a big breath in and a big breath out. On your next inhale, round up to a cat pose. On your exhale, cow as you push the hips back to a child's pose. Inhale, rounding forward and exhale, gliding back. Take two more like that. Beginning to arm the spine. Next inhale, stay forward. Tuck the toes under, send the hips high, downward facing dog. Bending one knee at a time. Tuning into the legs. Noticing any sensation that is coming up right now in the body. And remembering that those will all shift and change as we move. Coming to a still place, sweep your right leg to the sky. And then step right foot forward in between your hands. Left knee comes down. Gaze forward, breathe in. Press your hips back as you breathe out, half splits. One more like that. Inhale forward. And exhale back. Next, inhale, stay forward. Reach the arms to the sky. Take a breath in. Hands through your heart center and your breath out. Twisting left elbow to the right thigh. You can stay here or you can pick the left knee off of the floor. Take a big inhale. Twist a little bit deeper on your exhale. Next inhale, release back down, sweep the arms to the sky. Exhale one more time, push the hips back, half splits. Inhale, draw forward, plant the right foot, plant the hand, step back, downward facing dog. Left leg lifts, breathe in. Step forward in between your hands. Right knee comes down. Press the hips forward, gaze forward. And then press the hips back, half splits. One more like that, inhale. And exhale. Inhale forward, plant the left foot, lift the arms to the sky. Hands through the heart center and twist over towards the left. Taking your right elbow to the right, or to the left thigh rather. Maybe lifting the right knee. Take a big breath in. Twist a little bit deeper on your breath out. Releasing right knee down, arms to the sky. Exhale, push the hips back one more time, half split straight in the left leg. Next inhale, draw forward. Plant the hands, step back, downward facing dog. Inhale to lift the heels. Exhale, dip the heels to the left, stretch your right side body. Inhale through center and to the other side. Beautiful, inhale through center, heels melt down towards the floor. Take a big breath in and a big sigh, let it go. All right, let's take some down dog squats. So we're gonna start rolling forward to a high plank. Then we're gonna bend the knees, push the hips back towards the heels, straighten the legs, we're back and down dog. Let's move together in four, three, two, one. Plank, down dog squat, straighten, plank, bend, extend, plank, bend, extend. So you're pushing into the hands here the whole time forward, bend, straight, forward, bend, straight, forward, bend, straight. You've got it. Here's eight, seven, six. Here's five, 
four, we're gonna hold it in that plank. Find shoulder taps in two, in one. Shoulder taps right and left. Left, right, gaze a little bit forward. Can you charge up your legs here? Right, left, engage your core. Left, right, here's eight and six. Back to those down dog squats. In four, three, two, one, hands down. Bend, extend, plank, bend, extend, plank, bend, extend, plank, bend, extend, plank. So we're warming up the core here, as well as the legs. A Little bit of shoulder work. Extend, plank. You've got it. Here's four. Here's three. We're gonna keep it forward. In two, one. Shoulder taps, right, left, right, left. Keep gazing forward and breathe. Right, left, right, left. You've got it. Here's eight, seven, six, five, Here's four, three, one more set of those, two, one, both hands down, bend, extend, plank, bend, extend, plank, bend, extend, plank, bend, extend, plank, bend, extend, plank. Here's four. Here's three. Here's two, here's one, hold it in the plank, shoulder taps, last time, left and right. Final eight. Here's six, we're almost there. Here's four, three, two, one, hold your plank, chaturanga. Up dog, breathe in. Down dog, breathe out. Big breath in. And a big sigh. Beautiful, check back in. What has shifted since we started moving? Can you find a softness in your face? In your jaw, your shoulders, your neck? Trusting that you are here for a reason today. So can you be open to what is there for you to experience? Take a big breath in. And exhale. Inhale, lift your heels. Exhale, top of the mat. Halfway lift, breathe in. Fold forward, breathe out. Sweep up to stand. Exhale, right back down, fold. Halfway lift. Step back, high plank, chaturanga, up dog, down dog. Take a big breath in and a big breath out. Lift your heels, breathe in, step or float. Halfway lift, fold, sweep up, right back down. Halfway. Step back, high to low. Up dog as you breathe in. Down dog as you breathe out. Big inhale. And exhale. Lift your heels. Step top of the mat. Halfway. And fold. Chair pose, sit low. Take a breath in. On your exhale, airplane your arms, lift your heels. Inhale, chair. Exhale, airplane and lift. One more, inhale. Exhale. Inhale, chair. Exhale, fold. Halfway lift. High plank. Two chaturanga. Up dog. Down dog. 
Sweep your right leg to the sky. Step right foot forward. Crescent pose. Warrior two. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, cartwheel down. Chaturanga. Up dog. Down dog. Left leg lifts. Step. Crescent. Warrior two. Reverse, breathe in. Cartwheel down, exhale, chaturanga. Up dog. Down dog. Big breath in and out. Walk your hands back one step. Slide your right hand to your left shin, maybe your left ankle or heel. Breathe in. Twist as you breathe out. Look underneath your left armpit. Moving through center and switching sides. Left hand slides to the right shin, ankle or heel. Breathe in. And then twist. Slowly releasing. Walking the hands back out to your down dog. Take one cycle of breath here. Down dog is our rest pose as always. If you ever need child's pose, take it. Listen to your body. One big breath in. And exhale. Inhale, lift your heels. Exhale, step top of the mat. Halfway lift. Fold forward. Beautiful, roll up to stand. Grab your lighter set of weights. We're gonna step right foot towards the top of the mat. Left heel lifts, sit low into a chair as you bring the weights to your shoulders. We're gonna shoulder press as we tap left foot back. In four, three, two, one, right here. So it's tap press, forward, push, forward. So all the weight is in your right foot. Your elbows are drawing in towards the midline. Push forward, tap, tap. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Here's four, three. We're gonna keep it back, just the shoulders. Two, one, right here. Push, lower, push, lower. So you're leaning a little bit forward. Your core is engaged. Here's four. Three, let's add a lift on the left leg. Two, one, right here. Lift, lower, up, down. Squeeze your left glute, push. Here's four, we're gonna find warrior three. Take tricep kickbacks in two, in one. Weights to shoulders, hinge forward, lift your left leg. Pull your elbows by your sides, tricep kick, and forward, back. Forward, so your elbows stay high. You're squeezing the shoulder blades together. Your left leg is lifted, your right foot is rooted. Here's eight, seven, engage your core. Six, five, gaze forward, four, three. We're gonna find a little pulse in the arms. Two, one right here, push, push, squeezing the shoulders in towards the midline. Here's four, three, one more set of kickbacks. In two, in one, right here. Pull in, take it back, in and back, in and back. Lift your left leg a little bit higher. Here's four, three, we're gonna switch sides. Two, one, weights to heart. Step your left foot forward, lift your right heel. Weights back to your shoulders, same thing. Tap and shoulder press. In four, three, two, one. Right here, push forward, push forward. So now your weight is in your left foot. Your chest is broad. Your elbows are drawing in towards the midline. Push, shoulders, here's eight. Seven, six, we're gonna keep it back. Five, 
Here's four, three, two, one. Keep it back, just the shoulders. Four, three, we'll add that leg. Two, one, right here. So it's lift, lower, up, down. You're leaning forward, you're squeezing right glute. Here's four, three, we're gonna lean forward, tricep kickbacks in two, one, weights to shoulders, hinge forward, drop the weights down. Now pull the weights back up, elbows by the sides, kick it back, back, forward, back, forward, your elbows are staying high, your left foot is rooted, core is engaged, back, forward, back, forward, you've got it, here's eight, and six, here's four, we'll pulse, in two, one, keep it back, little pulse, pulse, I'm losing my balance a little bit, pulse, pulse, you've got it, here's four, one more set, in three, two, one, in, kick back, in, kick back, take your right leg a little bit higher, lean a little bit farther forward, Final eight, seven, six, squeeze your triceps, five, here's four, three, two, one. Come all the way up to stand, shake your legs out. Awesome work. All right, we're gonna put our light set of weights down, grab our heavier set. You can face the top of your mat giving yourself a little space towards the top. We're gonna bring the weights to the shoulders. We're gonna find a good morning, so it's essentially the same movement as a deadlift, but we're not gonna go farther down. So bend the knees, tuck the tail, engage the core. We're gonna lean forward, taking our shoulders in line with our hips, and then straighten back up. So down and up, down, and up, the weights are just at your shoulders for a little bit of extra resistance. Down and up, you can really rest them on your shoulders so your arms aren't picking up the work here. Put more weight into your heels and like you're sticking your booty back, trying to touch something behind you and then squeezing it at the top. Down and up, down and up. You've got it. Let's speed that movement up. Right here. Down, up, down, up. I like to keep a bend in my knees. My core is engaged. Squeezing your glutes at the top. Down, up, down, up. Here's eight. Here's six. Here's four, three, we're gonna add a squat. In two, in one, right here, so we're gonna go good morning, squat, back up, lift. Good morning, squat, straighten, lift. Down, bend, straight, and lift. Down, bend, straight, and lift. So super important here to engage your core. It's okay if you feel it a little bit in your back. We want to strengthen your muscles in your back body, but we don't want to cause any extra tension or pain in the low back. Here's eight. Here's six. Here's four. Three. Two. One. Full range squats, lower, lift, down, up. So your weights are still at your shoulders. Down, up, focusing on the legs. Squeeze your glutes, push into your heels. Chest is broad. Here's eight. Here's six. Here's four, we're gonna hold low. Little pulses 
in three, two, one, hold it low, pulse, pulse, dip, dip, so chest is broad, knees in line with ankles, pulse, 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 and pulse, you've got it, here's eight, seven, six, all right, we're going to go back to that squat, add a hamstring curl, in four, three, two, one, right here, so we'll go squat, right side curl, squat, left side curl, squat, curl, squat, curl, like you're squeezing your hamstring when you lift, squat, curl, stay engaged, here's eight, seven, six, five, here's four, three, one more set of pulses, two, one, hold low, just pulse, down, down, sit even lower, I know you can, finish line is there, we're so close, here's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, come to stand, Woo, awesome work. All right, drop one of the heavy weights. If you wanna get extra spicy, you can keep both of them. Take the heavy weight into your left hand. Your right hand will come to your hip. Lift your left heel, really plant your right foot, slight bend in the knee. Take your elbow by your side. We're gonna curl the left arm as we tap the left knee down and then come back up. Let's move to tempo. Four, three, two, one. So it's back. Curl, up, lift, back. Curl, up, lift. Let's speed that up. Back, back. So we're taking a reverse lunge and we're curling the left arm as we lunge. Forward, back, forward, back. You've got it. Eight, seven, six. Can you engage your core? Here's four, three, we're gonna hold it back. Two, one, hold it back, just curl down, up. Let's add a dip in that left knee into one. So it's down, dip, curl, down, dip, curl, lower, and lift. Here's eight, seven, Six, really squeeze your left bicep. Here's four, three, back to that beginning. Two, one, right here. So it's forward, lift, back, curl. Forward, lift, back, curl. So option here to lift your knee into your chest as you lift for a little bit of extra spice. Forward back, forward, back, forward, back, forward, back. Keep going. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Here's four. We're going to hold it back. Just curl in three, two, one, right here, add that dip, dip curl, lift, dip curl, lift, so good, my left bicep is definitely burning, hope yours is too, here's eight, seven, six, five, here's four, three, we're going to switch it up, we'll lean forward, Right from across the thigh, right here. Lean forward, right from across your thigh. Left leg starts long, left elbow to your right wrist. Isolated biceps in four, three, two, one. Right here, curl, drop, curl, curl. Really squeeze your left bicep. 
Here's four, we'll add a knee drop on that left leg as we curl. Two, one, split, tap, lift, tap, lift, curl, curl. Your right knee stays bent the whole time. Your chest is broad. You're squeezing your left bicep. Curl, lift. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Here's four, three, two, one. Put your left weight down. Left hand comes to the floor. Right hand comes to the floor. We're gonna pull the left knee behind the right, tap the right knee with the, or the left knee with the right hand, and then lengthen it back long. Cool? Let's go together right here. So it's pull, reach, pull, reach. So option to make it spicier, don't tap the arm and leg down. Option to stay there. A little bit of a rest as you tap the left foot down. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Here's four, we'll finish with a stretch. In three, in two, in one. Left foot down, right arm to the sky. Take a big breath in and a big breath out. Slowly release, right hand down. Push off of your left foot, step forward. Halfway lift and fold. Beautiful. All right, grab that weight. Left hand, or right hand rather, we just did the left. Your palm is gonna face forward. Your left hand will be at your hip. Push down into your left foot. We're gonna curl the right arm as we take the knee down and then lift it back up to the top. Let's move together. Four, three, two, one. Back and forward, back and forward. Let's speed that up. In three, right here. Back, forward, back, forward. So now you're squeezing your right bicep as you tap your right knee back, forward, back, back, and curl. Can you engage your core? Push into your left big toe. Forward, back, forward, back. Here's eight. Here's six, we're gonna hold it back. In four, three, two, one, hold it back, just curl. Down, up, let's add a dip as we curl right here. Dip, lift, curl, tap. Squeezing your right bicep, tap, lift, tap, lift. You've got it. Squeeze your inner thighs together, down, up. Here's four, three, two, one. Back to that first set. We're gonna pull in this time, knee to chest, and then step back, curl, up, curl, back, curl, up, curl, back, curl. I am sweating. So when you drive your knee into your chest, feel your core engage. We're working right bicep for the whole five minutes of this song, up and back. Here's eight. Here's six. Here's four. Three. Two. One, hold it back. Left arm across the left thigh, right. Elbow to the left wrist, just curl. Up, down, lift, lower. Up, down, lift, lower. You've got it. Eight, seven, six. We'll add that knee drop. In four, three, two, 
One, right here. Tap, lift, tap, lift, tap, lift, down, up. You've got it. Tap, tap, really squeeze, right bicep. Here's eight. And six. Here's four. Three, we're gonna put the weight down. Tap, left hand, right knee. Two, one, right weight down, right hand down. Left hand to the top corner, pull it in, take it long. In and long, in, long, in, long. Option to just hover your arm and leg the whole time. Out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Here's four, three, two, one. Keep it long, find a stretch. Lift your left arm to the sky. Take a big breath in. Twist a little bit deeper on your breath out. Left hand goes down. This time step back to a down dog. Lift both heels and then dip the heels to the left. Inhale through center and switch, heels to the right. Inhale through center, exhale, melt the heels down towards the floor. Take a big breath in and a big breath out. Inhale, lift your heels, exhale, step, top of the mat. Halfway lift and fold. Beautiful work. Slide your heavier weight out of the way. We're gonna make our way to the back of the mat. No weights needed for this song. Feet hips width, tuck the tail, engage the core. We're gonna pull the right knee into the chest. A lot of one-legged stabilization today. Then we're gonna fold, bend the left knee, find a little squat. Take the hands down, walk it out to a one-legged plank. And then walk it back. Trying to keep the right leg lifted, pull the right knee into the chest at the top. Cool? Let's move together. Four, three, two, one right here. So it's down and out, back and lift. Down and out, back and lift. Keep going. So really push into your left big toe. Find that full plank engagement. Engage your core the whole time. Forward, back, lift, down. So when we do these one-legged stabilization work, we're strengthening the muscles that stabilize our leg, as well as our joints, so our ankle joint, our knee joint, Lift, down, out, lift, down, out. Here's four, here's three, here's two, here's one, hold it in that plank, mountain climber start, right, left. Right, left. Gaze is forward. Push into your hands. Right, left. All right, let's speed this up. In two, one right here. Push, push. In, in. Drive, drive. Knees into the chest. Here's eight. Seven. Six. Five. Here's four. Three, two, one. Find your plank, just walk it back. We'll switch sides. Come to stand. This time, left knee into the chest. Same thing. Go down and out. Back and lift. Down and out. Back and lift. Down and out, back, 
and lift, keep going. So now pushing into your right big toe, feeling your core engaged the whole time. Here's eight. Here's six. Here's four. And three. Here's two. Keep it forward, mountain climbers. Here we go. Left, right. Left, right. Drive the knees in. Gaze is forward. Push into your hands. Let's speed this up. In four, three, two, one. Get it. Right, left. Right, left. In, in. Engage your core. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Here's four, three, two, one. High plank, downward facing dog. Take a big breath in and a big breath out. One more breath here, inhale and exhale. Awesome job. A little bit of cardio. All right, inhale, lift your heels. Exhale, top of the mat. Halfway lift. And deep fold forward. All right, grab a light weight. We're gonna come to a tabletop. So knees come down. Weight will be in your right hand to start. Right knee stays down. Left leg goes on long. Right arm goes long. Let's lift and lower. So it's up, down, lift, lower. So you're lifting the right arm with the weight. If at any time you feel like you wanna drop the weight, option to do so. Keep your core engaged. Lift, lift. Soften in your left elbow, lift. Here's four, we're gonna keep it lifted. Three, two, one, keep it lifted, tiny lifts. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Here's four. We're gonna find a lat pull in the right arm. Pull the left knee into the left elbow. In two, one, pump faces down. Pull in, take it out. In, out, in. Out, really push into your left hand. You're pulling your right elbow in and your left knee in. Out, in. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Here's four, we'll keep it in. Close and open. In three, two, one, keep it in. Close, open, close. Open, close, open, engage your core. Your gaze is forward. You're feeling this work through your whole midline. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Here's four, we're gonna keep it open. Tiny lifts in three, two, one right here, just eight, seven, six, five. Here's four, three, two, one. Right hand down, left knee down. We're switching sides. Weight in the left hand, right hand planted, right elbow bent, right leg long. Square the hips, point the right toes. Let's lift and lower. Four, three, two, one, lift, lower. So now we're squeezing the right glute. This one is so challenging for me. It's a lot of shoulder strength, a lot of core strength. Lift, lower. Here's eight, seven, six, five, tiny lifts in four, Three, 
to one keep it lifted right here. Just eight, seven, six, five. We'll pull in the elbow and knee in four, three, two, one right here. In, out, in, out, in, out, in, out. You've got it. In, in, pull, pull. Here's four. Here's three. We're going to keep it in. Open and close. In two. In one. Keep it open. Close, open. I meant keep it in. Open, close, open, close. Wide, center. Here's four. We're going to find that pulse. In three, two, one. Keep it open. Tiny lift. Up and up. Lift and lift. You've got it. Last push. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Here's four, three, two, one. Left hand down, right knee down. Awesome work. Put that light set to the top of the mat. Inhale, sweep the arms up, come to your knees. And then exhale, bend both elbows, just hold. A little bit of stretch through the side bodies, maybe bend over to the left, feeling that into your lat. And then switch, bend over towards the right. And then releasing, shake the wrists out. Awesome work. All right, so we're gonna move to a side plank sequence with one heavy weight. So we'll start down on the left forearm. We'll really push into the left forearm, take the weight to the right hip, knees together, toes together. Let's push into the left elbow to lift the hips right here. So it's push, lower, up, down. We're focusing on obliques on our left side. Push, lower, up, down. Knees together, toes together. Here's eight. Seven, six, five, you've got it. Here's four. Three, we'll keep it lifted. Tiny lifts. Into one right here. Lift, lift. So you're cinching your left side. Lift and lift. Here's eight, seven, six, five. You've got it. Here's four. Three, we're going to lower all the way back down, lift back up. Into one right here, down, up, down, up, lower, lift. So good. Here's four. Three, one more set of pulsing. Into one right here, tiny lift. Up and up, lift. Here's four, we're gonna switch sides. So we'll still work our left side. Switch the weight into the left hand. Right here, hips come down, feet slide in front of you. Weight in the left hand, right elbow down this time. We're gonna extend the left arm and left leg and then crunch the left knee in. So it's out, crunch, out, crunch. We're still working left shoulder as well. Your right knee is bent underneath you for stability. We're gonna add a lift as we crunch in four, three. So we'll push into the right elbow, two, one, right here. So it's lift, crunch, lower, lift, crunch, lower, up and up. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Here's four. We're going to keep it lifted. Little pull in, in two, in one right here, little pull. In, in, squeeze, squeeze. In, in, squeeze, squeeze. You've got it. Eight, seven, six, five. Here's four, three, 
two, one. Now lower all the way down. Right hand captures your head. We're moving to left glute. So it's an open, closed clamshell. So in that first set we did, we were also working our glute medius, a stabilizing glute muscle on our left hip. So we're still there, working our glute medius right now. It's open, close, open, close, out, in, open, close. Give me eight. Here's six. We'll find little pulses in four. Three legs will stay open. Two, one, right here, stay open, Cl open, open. Pulse, if I can talk, pulse. Here's eight, seven, six, five, here's four, three, two, one. Knees come together, toes go up, same thing. Open, close, open, close, open, close, you've got it, open open, squeeze your left glute, open, 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 face is soft, jaw is relaxed, here's eight, seven, six, five, here's four, three, two, little pulse, in one, right here, little pulse, open, Pulse, lift, and lift. Here's four, three, two, one. Knees come together, left leg goes long. Lift and tap, lift and tap. So your left leg is at the diagonal. Turn your toes down so that you're in internal rotation in your left thigh. Down, up, you've got it, down. Lower, lift. Feel that point of max effort when you open to the top. Close, open, close, open. You've got it. Here's eight, seven, six, five little pulses in four. Then we're done. Three, two, one. Keep it open, little pulse. Here's eight. Here's six. Here's four. Three, two, one. Iso hold for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Holy shakes. Awesome work. Capture your left foot in your left hand. Kick it back for a little stretch. Awesome. One cycle of breath here. Also opening through that left shoulder feels so good after all of that shoulder work. All right, when you are ready, slowly release. We're gonna start on this side. So right forearm will go down. Left hand with the weight to your left hip crease. We're gonna lift and lower. Push into your right elbow in four, three, two, one. Lift. Lower, up, down. So now we're squeezing our right side, pushing into our right elbow. Lift, lower, you've got it. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Here's four, we'll keep it lifted. Tiny lifts in three, two, one, get it. Up and up, lift and lift. Really squeeze your right side up and up. If you'd ever need to readjust your right elbow, do so. We don't want any crunching or pain in the right shoulder. Lift, lift. Here's four, we're gonna lower and lift full range. In three, two, one, lower, 
lift, lower, lift, down, up, down, up. You've got it, lower, lower, lift, down, up. Keep going, eight, seven, six, five. We'll keep it lifted, A little pulse up. In three, two, one, keep it lifted, little pulse, up and up, lift and lift. Here's four, then we're gonna switch sides. In three, two, one, right here. Lower the hips, slide your feet in front of you. Come onto your left side now, knees together. Then lower, or extend your right arm and your right leg. We're gonna crunch in, out, crunch, long, nice. All right, let's add that lift in the hips, into one. So it's crunch, lift, lower, crunch, lift, lower, up. Up, really push into your left elbow, up, and lift, crunch, Crunch. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Here's four. We'll keep it in. In three, in two, in one. Keep it in. Little crunch. In, in, crunch, and crunch. You've got it. Here's eight, seven, Six, five, here's four. We're gonna lay all the way down. Left hand captures the head. In two, in one, lay all the way down. Left hand captures the head. Weight into the right thigh, right hip crease, clamshells. Open, close, open, close, open, close. You've got it, open, open. So you're holding the weight there on your right thigh with your right hand. You're squeezing your right glute medius as you open. You've got it. Open, close, open, close. Keep going. Open, close. Open, close. Open, close. Open, close. Here's eight. Here's four. We're going to keep it open. Tiny pulse in three, two, one. Keep it open. Tiny lift. Out, out, back, back. Push, 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 push. You've got it. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Here's four, knees together. We'll make the shape bigger. In three, two, one, right here. Knees together, toes up. It's open and close, open, close, squeeze. Squeeze, this is where I really start to shake. Open, close. Open, close, you've got it. Out, out. So your toes stay together. Out. Here's four, we're gonna pulse. Three, two, one, keep it open. Tiny lift, eight, seven, six, five. Then we're gonna straighten right leg in four, in three, in two, in one, right here, knees together, straighten your right leg, point the toes, lift and tap, lift and tap. Turn your right toes down so that you have internal rotation in your right thigh, close, open, get it, eight, seven, six, we're pulsing, in five, in four, three, two, and one, final push, eight, 
and six. We'll hold in four, three, two, one. I so hold eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Lower down. Woo! Awesome work. Push up onto a seat. And then for this, just move your weight out of the way. And then come to lay on your back. So we're laying all the way on our back. Feet step down, hands behind the back of the head. Let's just crunch up. Lift, lower, up, down. It's like you're drawing your ribs towards your hip bones. Here's eight, seven, six, five. We'll pulse in four. Three, two, one. Keep it lifted, tiny pulse. Up, up. Now walk your feet forward one more step. Up and up. We're gonna find a full sit up. We'll twist right elbow, left knee. Not yet. In three, two, one. So we're gonna lay all the way back. Full sit up, crunch, left knee, right elbow, then lay back down. Sit up and twist, down, up, twist, and down, up, twist, and down, up, twist, and down. You've got it. Eight, seven, six. If you need to modify, you can be here. Here's four, here's three, here's two, we're gonna keep it up. Tiny pulse, right here, tiny pulse, in, in. Now baby, hover your right leg, in, 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 pulsing left. Here's eight, seven, six. We're gonna go back down to that crunch in three, two, one, low all, lower all the way down to your back. Just crunch up, down, lift, lower, crunch, crunch. Here's four, three, we're gonna keep it up. Tiny pulse, into one right here, lift, lift. Now walk your feet forward one step. We have one more side, lift, lift up up here's four we're gonna find that twist to the right in three two one right here so we're gonna lay back come up twist left elbow right knee lay back up and twist down lay back up and twist those full sit-ups are so hard down and twist. Let's get four, then we'll pulse. Three, two, one. Give me that pulse. In, in. Maybe lengthen left leg. It's in and in. Pulse and pulse. Final eight and six. Here's four. Three, two, one. Both feet down, hands behind you. Push the hips up. Reverse table. Take a big breath in. And sigh. <sighs> awesome. Come down to your sit bones. Beautiful work. High five. You made it. 60 minute class. I bet you killed it. Cross your ankles. Come to tabletop. So you're on hands and knees. Knees under hips, wrists under shoulders. Inhale, drop the belly, lift the tailbone, cow pose. Exhale, tuck round, push into the hands as you arch the upper back. Inhale, cow. Exhale, cat. A few more on your own, adding in any movements that feel good here. Rolling the hips side to side, shaking it out. 
holding any shape that you want a couple extra breaths in. When you're ready, meet me in a neutral table. Push down into your left hand, sweep your right arm to the sky. Thread your right shoulder underneath you. Come on to the side of the right, the right side of the face. So your right shoulder is down. Your left hand can walk forward and twist you a little bit deeper. This should feel really good. Maybe lengthening left leg long, keeping the hip square. If you want more of a challenge, I'm going to take my left knee back down. You can lift your left arm to the sky and then thread it through left hand to the right hip crease and then straighten the left leg. All are options. You go where you feel like you get the best stretch. Full round of breath here. When you're ready to release, left hand comes down. Push into it, lift your right arm to the sky. And then just a couple big circles in the right shoulder. A lot of shoulder work today. Switch the direction of those circles. And then right hand back down. Let's switch it out. Left arm to the sky. Thread it underneath. Come on to the left shoulder, the left side of the face. Right hand either walks forward or you can take in, thread it around into the left hip. Maybe straightening your right leg long depending on how deep of a stretch you are feeling like today. Breathing long, slow, deep breaths. When you're ready to come out, right arm to the sky and then to the floor, left arm lifts up. Take a couple circles, moving into the shoulder joint, whole range of motion, and then switch. Left hand goes down, cross your ankles underneath you, come back to a seat, and then come to a wide fold. Flex the toes. Send your pinky toes behind you so you're externally rotating the thighs. Soften in the knees here. We're going to flow a couple times, right hand down to the right shin, sweep left arm by the ear, and then switch it right away to the other side. So working into our side bodies, our lats. Should feel really good. Those are parts on my body that tend to stay sore the longest or get sore the quickest. So as you stretch, being mindful of things like that in your own body, tendencies that you have, the next time you get on the right, stay there. And since this is a practice, we're always coming back to it, always learning, always improving, changing, growing, knowing that you don't have to see a tangible shift when you notice something, that it's just working into your subconscious, there for future classes so that you know you're continually learning how your body is moving in the world. And then switch sides. Left arm comes down, right arm reaches. So good. I feel like I could stay here forever. Pushing down through the right hip to maximize that stretch even more. And then coming through center, now walk your hands out into a forward fold. You can come down onto forearms, you can make a pillow with two fists. Maybe you can lay your head down on your hands. Important thing is toes stay flexed, heels are pointing away from you, and soft bend in the knees so that we're not cranking on our knee joints. Envisioning getting your spine a little bit more flat. So tailbone goes up, chest goes forward. 
That will also maximize the stretch in the hamstrings. When we tilt our tailbone up, it will lengthen our hamstrings since our hamstrings connect at our glutes. Long, slow, deep breaths. And then when you're ready, slowly pressing up into a seat. Take your right foot in towards your left. Now take your right hand behind you. Lift your left arm by your ear as you push your hips forward. Finding this little stretch. And then switching sides. Right leg goes long, left knee comes in. Push the hips forward. And then lowering back down. Coming to a seat, close your eyes. One final moment to check in. Notice how you feel. If you want a Shavasana right now, I urge you to take it. Otherwise, let's clear a breath. Big breath in. And big breath out. Hands to forehead center. Together we say namaste. Beautiful work. Thank you so much for being here with me. I will see you in my next video. Bye.